to another one. Oh, we got another awesome little farm video planned for today. Awesome little challenge. It's gonna be a ton of fun. We're meeting Jordan at the dairy farm and uh, it just got done raining yesterday. Everything's full of water, mud, cow poop everywhere. Thank goodness we got a sponsor for today's video. I wanna give a huge shout out to Hycia for sponsoring today's video. What's Hycia, you ask? This is Hycia, oh yeah. These sweet boots, ankle boots. They're sweet, and that's not all they make. They make waders and a bunch of other outdoor products as well. These boots are perfect for summer, let me tell you what. Not only are they breathable, due to the breathable air mesh lining, so it allows air to travel through the boot. Air mesh lining is what they use for high-end running shoes. So this keeps your feet drier and ventilated a ton longer. Not only that, but it has this awesome little flip-up design that flips up around your ankle and then a drawstring to pull it tight. So now with that bad boy tightened, no debris can get in here. My goodness, these bad boys are comfy though. And waterproof, which is gonna be awesome for today's hunt because like I said, it rained all day yesterday. I'm sure there's cow poop flowing. Y'all have been to the farm enough, you know what I'm talking about. So we're gonna put these bad boys to the test today. We're gonna go romping and stomping through the muck and see how they actually work. If you guys want to check out these Hycia boots that I'm wearing, all you got to do is go down in the description below and I'll link it down there. It doesn't matter if I'm hunting, fishing, doing some garden work, going on a farm hunt. These are going to be my new go-to bad boys right here. I love these ankle boots. They make it nice. They make it comfortable, easy walking. Well, we are here at the dairy farm and I am prepared for anything. What are you doing, man? Waiting. Waiting. What's yep. in your hand there? What do you got? The old 17? Yeah. Ooh. No camera on her today, though. No so. camera. Let's see you are barefoot. Got to get back to them roots. Got to get back to them roots? Wish I should have brought my boots, though. Should have brought your boots? We got to get you some of these bad boys right down here. I'm telling you what, these bad boys, dude, they're nice. They look comfy. They are. They're I have to steal them from you to try them on. Well, they sent me two pairs, but the other pair is a size 12. That's perfect. That's, you, are you a size 12? I'm 11 and a half. So oh, with a big perfect. sock, you'll fit them. Oh, but this is the gun of choice today. This is actually <laughs> Jordan. He's ah. already done a, wait, hold on a minute. You've already done a video with this. I have done a couple it's of them. It's on his channel. Yeah. If you want to go watch it, he'll be linked down below. It's, that's a hard gun to play with. That's, <laughs> that's a rough one. That's what you've been saying. <laughs> Quick rundown real quick. I didn't buy this gun. How much was it? This gun actually cost me under a hundred bucks. Under with tax. Bucks. Wow. With tax under a hundred bucks. Wow. Which, show them uh, show them what it does. Uh okay. So this here is a single shot. You pull on the, the trigger guard, and that's what breaks it. And it's actually a breakdown model. So you can actually fit it into a backpack, all mm. sorts of fun stuff like that. It looks good with the so, old shot cam on there. It does. Yeah, buddy. Cheapest Walmart shotgun challenge on the farm. Let's go. Well, here we go. Buster open. This is a single shot, in fact, break barrel shotgun. Boom. I'm not going to cock her yet until I'm ready. Oh, these boots, though. <laughs> no cow poop is going to get to me today. Ooh. Oh, come over. Oh. Those weren't starlings. Nope. Come on over. Here we go. Oh, they're gonna land. They're gonna land up there. Darn it, two pigeons. They love it up there. Oh, it's okay, it's okay. Girls, keep eating, keep eating. Hi, oh, girl, what are you doing? You're a good looking girl. Bob's doing better with my gun again. <laughs> Any single shot that I have. Oh, uh, so I just, yeah, I smoked that guy. That was awesome. Starling down. I did not get the GoPro on. I did, I'm pretty sure I got the shot cam on. Here he is. Let's go get him. First shot of the day. I connected. I don't know what you're talking about, but that bad boy is deadly, dude. I mean, it was spot on. Uh oh. Ah, oh, darn it. This Call gun's junk. 
Call it beginner's <laughs> luck. That is, hey, just like my Benelli the other day on the pigeon hunt, I couldn't hit a thing. Put a new gun in my hand. It's like it's less stress or something. I don't know. Well, there's no pressure. There's no pressure, yeah. It's just like, I miss because it's, I'm not used to it. Exactly. All right, one shell, one bird down. Load her up and let's go. I can't believe that. I really shocked, shocked I shocked myself there. I'm not gonna be cocky about it at I all. I was like, I'm gonna back him up. <laughs> I'm gonna smoke this it's dead. <laughs> oh, darn it. I had the camera ready and everything. You don't like that old cylinder bore at that range? Dude, that cylinder <laughs> bore at that range did great, but at that range, heck no. Mm. Oh, you got him. Nice I shot. Myself. I, I was get one. <laughs> I was just waiting until you pulled. I'm like, I'm just going to pull it too. Like, wait, I thought I was supposed to run back up. <laughs> oh, I thought he was going down for a second. I actually thought you So did. that's the you second time that when I shoot it, it automatically does that. Is it supposed to do that? No, you you're pulling on the trigger guard a little bit. Oh. Boy, these boots, I'll tell you what. These things are awesome. These boots are a game changer. It's so nice not having calf high, you know, mud boots on. The rubber boots, the cheap ones, these things are comfortable and they're really reasonably priced. We guys really ought to go down in the description and check these bad boys out. They're nice. Like a bar swallow. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Should have tried them. Dude. As you guys can see, check it out. Uh, there's a Kansas Spring Storm a brewing right now. And, uh, oh, look at this guy. Hi, Robin. Oh, that's a Robin. My bad. <laughs> My bad. Cut! <laughs> oh, goodness. I did not get that on the GoPro yet again. I didn't even have mine on. I'm really hoping I got it on the shot cam. Dude, he came out right there. Get a circle. Right. Literally just smoked a pigeon. Yep, there he is, right on the road. I'm hoping I got it on the shot cam. Uh, I bumped it. It should have went. It should have been going. But here he is. That was an awesome, awesome shot through the through the tree. <laughs> Ooh, definitely a young bird. Check him out. There he is. <laughs> Walmart cheapest shotgun challenge. There we go, girls. There we go. Well, we're in the barn here. An old monkey man himself, dude. I'm serious. All the time. Dude, you got baby, you got kids at home. You can't be doing dangerous stuff like this, man. Yeah, he earlier he said, I gotta prove to myself that I still can. So that there is the hole that I was trying to shoot them uh starlings and sparrows coming out of. I don't know, that's probably seven videos ago. As you can tell, listen. It's pouring rain outside. So we came in here to uh, take shelter just for a little bit. Uh, we're going to let this storm pass. Well, it has stopped raining. Check it out. We got a wet ground. Damp ground, not wet. Can you even see the rainbow over there? I don't know. Maybe you guys can see the, the rainbow over there. Beautiful little rainbow. Cool. But we're at the shed. And something will probably fly out of this bad boy. Let me cock her back. Let's get ready to go, boys. Yep. All right. All right. Jordan's gonna flush him out. Uh, there's a starling in here somewhere. At least one starling. Nothing. I know. <laughs> yeah, you need some boots on them tootsie, son. Oh. Don't do. Oh. Too late now. No. Now our feet are the same color, except <laughs> yours are all nice and dry. Oh no. Mm. Hello girls. Hello girls. Oh, you're a big girl. You're quite the big girl. Well, that's not Mine. a very complimentary thing. To yeah. Say. <laughs> Maybe it is a complimentary thing to say to these big girls. I bet they like it. I bet they do too. Uh-huh. The cows. Yep, this is what's good about these boots. I warned y'all. Nothing but cow poop. The entire dairy for farm, nothing but cow poop. I walked around it. You did. Thank I, goodness. I, yeah, that stuff will stick in your feet forever. And being married... The wife don't want to have you come home 
and then they smell cow poop all over them feet. Get yourself a good pair of boots. Yeah, we better get back over there. Well, we're gonna head back to where we were earlier. We're gonna crawl over and around all this cattle fencing. You know the deal. All of you have been here on these uh, old farm hunts. You know the deal. But this is the fly line right here. Right here where the ponds are right here. This is the fly line. This is the place to stand. Duck. Yep, yep, he sure did. On, so I was uh, I was gonna shoot at a different sparrow. What's that? Sparrow or not? That's a barn swallow. Okay, don't Those shoot it. Good. Those are good. There's a sparrow on this side. That's what I thought you were going for. Nothing. Pizza for the cows? Wow, it is a lot of pizza. Look at all this pizza. Holy smokes! I think it's cheese pizza. Look at all that. I'm kind of tempted to take a bite. Uh, I am too. It kind of it smells good right it now. Smells delicious. Wow. Oh, it smells really good. A whole pile of pizza for the cows. I want to eat it. If I knew exactly how long I've been here, which it can't be long here. It could have been here longer than a day. I'm really tempted to, you know, dig in just a little bit. Oh, find a moist. And then dig in. Yeah, I'm telling you, that smells good. Now here in uh, probably a day or two, it won't be smelling so good. It gets bad. Wow, ha, 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 ha. that is all chocolate. Look at the Reese cups. Are those Reese's? Uh, looks like they're a peanut chocolate cup. Oh, I'll be darned. Yeah, peanut and chocolate. We better try one. Not my favorite. Oh, I'll try one. I love peanut and chocolate. Oh, yeah. So, this one, oh, wow. Big slabs of chocolate. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Wow. So all this chocolate comes in. Um, um, I say it all the time. Every three weeks, yeah. Thank you, Jordan. Um, every three weeks, big old batches of chocolate like this comes in. Sugar substitute for the dairy cows to produce a lot of good old milk. These are my favorite. What flavor is that? It's like a, whoop. Mm. Whoops. It's like a truffle thing. Truffle, oh yeah. Mm. Well, you know the deal. All this chocolate, uh, they got Ziploc bags for us to take, which thank you so much. I appreciate it so much. That is awesome. But I am going to fill up this bag. These peanut chocolate deals right here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, dude, the old Festiva. Isn't she pretty, though? Yeah, dude. She, she gets it like done. Spring. She gets it done. Oh, yeah. Old Festiva. The best car for gas mileage, I'm telling you right now. And right now, I can fill her up for 10 bucks. Wow, 10 <laughs> bucks. Hey, ready? Well, oh, there goes one starling. Look at him, he's proud. He's like, this is mine. Do not touch it. <laughs> so, uh, these starlings are invasive. They're an invasive species. That's why there's no seasons or anything on them. Feed the cats. They like it. I'd like it too if I was a cat. Oh, look what I got. Oh, is that chocolate, Bubba? Yeah, you want some? You do? Mama, do you want some? Jordan, I thought we were friends. <laughs> Jordan, yeah, I, I knew not that. not nice. I knew when I brought this in, you were gonna be like, why do you have that? Yeah. Not good. Not good. Probably would have been better just to cook a bird. Uh, a lot healthier, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, hold on, dude. Sis, you want some? You do? <laughs> they already spotted it in my, in my truck earlier, so the surprising factor, it's really not there. I think they already went snooping through it, too. You want that one right there? Yeah. Which one? Down right there. Right there. Okay, let's get it. All right. Oh, you want that one? That one. Oh, not that one. This one? Yeah. This one? Oh, there you go, bub. How's it taste? Give us a taste test. Take a bite. Pretty good? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Your turn, sis. Which one do you want? This comes from a cow farm, you know that? Huh? She don't care. She's like, I know what's good, Dad. You did snoop in my bag earlier, didn't you? You did? Okay, you gotta try one. 
Gotta try one. It's from the dairy. No! It's just extras. They're safe. They're good. Yeah, they're safe and full of sugar. And we're trying to get fit. I'm not trying. That's a double. That's a triple. Oh, no, I'm not trying to get fit at all. That is delicious. <sighs> but today's hunt, it was a little shorter uh, than usual, but I enjoyed it. Cheapest shotgun challenge. I didn't think I was going to get it done that good. Shot a starling and one pigeon. Went way better than I thought. Uh, Jordan was right. For, first of all, that shotgun is under a hundred dollars brake barrel single shot and you have to cock the hammer back to, to fire it now the trigger pull is literally a mile long i wanted to show you guys more of the gun but we got rained out again i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did smash the thumbs up button for your boy and if you haven't hit the notification bell down there do it because it will notify you when i upload it'll give you a little notification on your mobile phone and you'll be like huh yep we're gonna watch it and a huge shout out to Hysia for sponsoring this here video, y'all. I'm telling you what, these boots are low cut, they're versatile, and they're great for summer. They're gonna be really comfortable in the field too, so I can't wait to get in the field duck hunting and goose hunting with them as well. Again, I will link these boots if you wanna cop a pair down in the description below. They are not expensive at all, and they beat the heck out of those cheapy rubber boots. You know, the real, real cheap ones that are just rubber? I don't know, these got some foam in the inside. They're nice. So again, a huge shout out to Hysia for sponsoring this video yet again. Their products are amazing. Go check them out. But until next time. Peace. I've been getting laid back. Baby, you should know that. I don't need your criticism, pessimism. I've been keeping it on the DL Got a girl that keeps it real